Ask Reddit by Altera33. What are the most positive things happening in the world right now that people don't think of? After being diagnosed with breast and colon cancer last fall, my mom is, as of today, officially cancer free. Fantastic news. It's so easy to repopulate the earth of rare plants now through tissue culture. Two years ago Brazil was freaking out trying to keep their last remaining spiritus sancti plants to themselves and today, anyone can have them in their house and there is no market for poachers. A two year gap between those extremes is insane. This guy honked at me for not going on green light fast enough, then caught up to me at the next light rolled down his window and apologized for having a bad day and then drove off and waved. Also, interest in sustainable housing is growing all the time. Things like earth ships and rammed earth houses are gaining ground slowly. That's an amazing post honk gesture. A malaria vaccine has been developed and is currently undergoing human trials. This could save hundreds of thousands of lives a year, many of them children. I was part of some human trials for this back in 2018. Lots of blood tests and health screenings, multiple vaccine shots, deliberate mosquito bites from buggers that were raised in a special lab to have malaria, then blood tests 10 days in a row, and I didn't get malaria. Pandas are no longer an endangered species. In spite of their own best efforts. Grey whale population has grown 20% in California in the last year https colon slash slash mexicanewsdaily.com slash news slash gray dash whale dash population dash baja dash california dash sir slash a few global public health things we have made tremendous progress on ending the aids epidemic in the last 40 years the percentage of adults that smoke cigarettes is lower than it has been historically we went from like 800k cases of guinea worm in the world in the late 80s to 12 in 2022. I can relate. I'm a registered nurse who graduated university in 1986. I took care of a lot of AIDS patients. It was the most horrible experience seeing such young vibrant people so sick and dying. There were no effective treatments available. Just palliative care. Fire families were so traumatized as well. The breakthroughs over the year in the treatment of HIV is amazing to me. Edit, thanks to all the people who wrote little comments regarding my entry. I can't believe how therapeutic it's been for me. For the first time in decades there have been Iberian lynx sightings in the region of Madrid. Two sightings in the last week, huge news as this species is among the most endangered animals in the world. In general, birds and mammals in many parts of Europe show positive population and range trends in recent years. For example, wolves and beavers and eagles are strongly on the rise in Germany again to a point they are almost common. The former two even cause a lot of controversies because of that. There are exceptions, of course. California's Lake Oroville is now back at being 100% full after being dangerously low from years of drought. As a California local, I'm stoked to have learned this today. For the first time ever the ambulance company I work for has a good amount of employees so everyone isn't severely overworked. OMG I've literally never heard of EMS being fully staffed before, in any area, that's awesome. I finally got prescribed proper pain medication and I no longer want to die most days. The best feeling the oh wow I can do so much more now, I didn't think it was possible moment is everything. The us has more trees now than it did 100 years asset percent 20 harvest percent 20 since percent 20 the percent 201930 s. I just saw a video about how it's not as effect as old forest. Since most areas have the same height trees they don't allow for other vegetation to grow that's beneficial to ecosystems. But still good news. Edit, https colon slash slash, slash tp3il72wy4a here is the video.
he he takes you a few steps and you can see the difference. More people than ever before have access to clean drinking water and basic sanitation which is saving thousands of lives. This is so true. I've been working on a project in rural Ghana where we've actually been pumping treated water directly into people's homes that is totally safe to drink. It's incredible what we're able to do right now. Some garage scientists in Germany have invented energy production plants that create green hydrogen from literally every kind of waste you can imagine. It will revolutionize local and state energy production to a never seen before level. The company is called Uniwastec and is based in Switzerland. Couple that with the progress made on nuclear fusion and human energy production will become OP within our lifetimes. My lazy ass decided I should finally go in for a physical and it turns out they found a thoracic aortic aneurysm that could have killed me instantly. Having open heart surgery in the next few days to fix it. Good for you. Inspiration or intuition? Either way good luck with the surgery. We're pulling for you. Honeybees are at a all time high, and are now considered overpopulated. The whole save the bees was never made for honeybees, but instead other species such as the mining bees. Bees can mine now. What will they think up next? My very old cat got her blood work done today and everything seems to be great. Amazing. My senior cat recently was given a clean bill of health as well. Here's to healthy and happy kitties. This is silly, but... I got a new job in a field I love after job hunting for ages and working so many jobs I hated, and I'm happier than I've been in a very long time. I feel like my life finally has direction. Teen pregnancy is way down https colon slash slash www.gutmarker.org slash graphics slash heading down open bracket graph closed bracket dash rev dot png it drops off significantly once they reach 20 yo crocodiles like pink flowers and i think we should talk at that more what pink flowers specifically Though I got let go on Monday, a ton of people I have worked with or otherwise built great relationships with have reached out in support and offered assistance of all kinds. Restoring my faith in humanity. People are becoming more trauma informed, facing their wounds, and making sure the next generation's burden will be at least a little lighter. Had a friend tell me recently they had a fight with their mother and told their mum to go to therapy. So now their mum is going to therapy and has already started seeing positive progress in her life. It's helping both lineage directions and wonderful to see people healing. We have more knowledge and connectivity at our fingertips than ever before. Our ancestors may have only had a 5th grade education but we can google lecture videos of nuclear physics. This needs to be appreciated more, would have given an award if I had one. I found love again for the first time since being widowed 4 years ago. I recent bought a small but modest home that I can call my own. And I got a pay rise. I genuinely feel the most at peace I have in 4 years. Some lakes in California are at 100% capacity due to the heavy rains during the winter spring. This is very small. But roughly 5 years ago I had tried to off myself. I was at an awfully low point in life, and had been since I was quite young, was convinced I'd never grow out of it I would always suffer. While there are still bad days, I can confidently say I'm glad I didn't succeed and I wake up happy to be here. It's small, but finally getting my lifelong depression managed, and beginning to seriously manage my PTSD has changed my life for the better. I think ozone layer is slowly healing itself, as well as my depression. It's been getting better and better since the 90s because back then we listened to the scientists and banned the emissions that were depleting it. This should teach us a lesson and do the same with the climate change. Also congrats for being overcoming your depression. HIV plus may soon have a cure, and it turns negative. 
case of negative being positive news. I've heard it's not the death sentence it used to be and is fairly manageable with medication these days. I became a doctor yesterday. I don't mean to sound conceited or anything, but I am almost to my goal of 200 pounds currently at 210 started at 316 two years ago.